Okay, here's my second try at creating a video for graphing one variable inequalities. Um, we wanted to start off and get down the basics of, of graphing inequalities on a number line. So to begin with, we'll look at something simple like x is greater than or equal to 5. On a number line, there are infinite numbers that are actually bigger than 5. I mean, we could spend all day listing those numbers off. You know, 6, 7, 8, 148. Those are all numbers bigger than 5. So instead of listing those all off, we use a number line to give us a visual of all the numbers that are bigger than or equal to 5. So the first thing we want to do is create a number line with an appropriate scale. So here's a number line just going up by ones, and we want to show the negative side of the number line. And the number line extends both directions forever, so we show that by putting arrows on either side of our number line. Now we want all the values that are greater than or equal to 5. And so because we have this or equal to part under that, we want to show that the value can include the number 5. And we show that by putting a closed dot or a closed circle on the number 5. And all the numbers that are greater than 5 are this direction on the number line. And so this is how we show all numbers greater than or equal to 5. So the next example I want to show you is, is one where it's not inclusive of the number we're talking about. So let's do something like x is less than negative 2. So we start off the same way. We want to draw our number line and have an appropriate scale. We want to show that the number line extends both directions. We'll just arbitrarily call that 0, and this is 1, 2, 3, 4, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4. So in this case, I don't have the or equal to symbol under that. So I want to show all the numbers that are strictly smaller than negative 2. Why well, no numbers like negative 3, negative 4, negative 5? all the way over here, negative 10, those are all numbers that are smaller than negative 2. But I also have numbers in here like negative 2 and 1 half, negative 2.1, negative 2.001. Those are all numbers that are smaller than negative 2. And what I want to show is I can get numbers like negative 2.0000001. That's smaller than negative 2, and it's really, really close to negative 2 on the number line but it's not actually number negative 2. So in order to show that I can get really, really close to negative 2, but that it's not equal to negative 2, I'm going to indicate that with an open circle around negative 2. And what that really tells me is I can get really, really close to that value, but I can't equal that value. And just like above, I want to show the direction where all the numbers exist that are smaller than negative 2 well, on a number line those numbers exist this way. So this shows me all the numbers that are strictly smaller than negative 2. So a couple important things to remember. If we have an or equal to symbol under our inequality, we're going to include that value and show that by including a closed circle on the number line. If it's strictly just less than or greater than without the or equal to symbol, we're going to show that with an open circle and then an arrow pointing to all the values that meet that criteria. Thank you.